Hi, this is Erin from MCP Actions. Today I'm going to show you how to take a layout that you've created either and present it or display it and change the orientation or rotate it in other words. I'm currently in Lightroom's library module so to begin my layout I'm going to go to the print module and the template that I want to build today is in our 5 by 7 section for print it is the four horizontal photo template. Now what I actually want is to rotate this entire template so that it is less wide than it is tall and that I have four vertical photos. I've got a collection already created down here that I want to add my photos to. You can see that these photos are oriented vertically. My photo cells are horizontal. So I'm going to start with my first image and drag it and drop it into the cell. And then I am going to use Command or Control and the square bracket key that is above the Enter key on my keyboard. So I'm holding down Command on a Mac or Control on a PC and I hit the square bracket key that faces to the left. That rotates my image clockwise. And then I can hold down Command or Control and move the image slightly um, if I want to. I think this is actually okay. Next, I'm going to take the image that I want to be at what will be the top left corner of my template, and one more time I'm going to rotate the photo by typing Command or Control and the left facing square bracket key. So I will continue doing that until my template is built. Finally, I've got this last photo. So one last time, Command or Control in the square bracket key. Now I've got a vertically oriented template. I can print this to a JPEG just as I normally would. If I want to show it to a client from within Lightroom as a JPEG, I would save it just following these settings right here. I'll go ahead and hit Print to File. I will save it to my desktop. And once it saves, I'll return to the library module. You can see that all my photos are still rotated, and so to rotate them back, I use the same um, shortcut combination, except that I use the right-facing square bracket to rotate my photos counterclockwise. So I did save that template onto my desktop. I want to synchronize my desktop folder now, so you can see it up here in my Macintosh hard drive settings. I'm going to right click on it, select synchronize, and then I'll hit this synchronize button and I'll only need to select the template that I just created. So I'm going to uncheck everything. Here's the template that I just created. I'm going to put a check mark there and select import. Now that the template has been imported, I'll hit enter to bring it into loop view and I will rotate it one more time. And so now I've got the photo oriented as I'd like it. Thanks so much for watching. If you have other questions about our present it or display it templates for Lightroom, watch our videos. We've got videos that tell you how to install and use each set, as well as a video on how to create a before and after to post on the internet using display it. We have a video telling you how to customize your ID plate or watermark. We also have videos on changing the size of your display it template. We've got videos on adding color blocks or background paper to your images. And we finally have a video on troubleshooting for any issues that you might encounter. Thanks so much for watching and enjoy your templates.